As a graphic designer, I found out that we found it difficult to generate colors for our designs. All right, don't panic. In this video, I will show you guys this website. I found out where you can generate colors for your project or design. All right, so if you're new, please don't forget to subscribe. So if you come over to this website, colorhunt.co, I'm going to put the link in the down description below. Now, if you come over to this website, you can see different colors. All right, calm down you will see different colors. Now you can actually explore all this, all these bars in this place. You can see vintage. Let me just click on vintage. You can see vintage colors. Let me click on neon colors. You can see neon colors. These are neon colors. All right, I think this will actually solve a lot of problem. Now come over to gold. You can see these are gold colors. All right, now come over to warm. You see these are warm colors that you can use for a project. Now let's come over to light color. Now these are light colors you can use for your project. Now this light color in terms of social media, um, design, social media, you know, all those social media um, flyers, like all those corporate brand social media flyers. You can actually use this light color to, you know, play around it. You understand? Now let's see code. And you can see cold colors. Now, the very sweet part of this is when you come over to this search palette. All right, you can see blue, teal, mint, green, sag, yellow, a lot of it. All right, so let's click on this teal, green. Now you can see these are teal, green. These are colors that we can match that color. All right, so this um, website will not only give you the color, it will give you the primary and the secondary colors. Do you understand? Like I told you, I'm not promoting this website. I'm just trying to help you guys. I help myself. All right, so let's assume you want to make use of this color and or this one. And the funny part is, you can see it gives you the color code of these colors. If you point at them, you see their color code. All right. So now let's assume you want to make use of this color. Now it will open. Like I said, if you point at it, this is the color code for this color. This is the color code for this one. This is the color code for this one. Now, what you, if you want to get this on your on your laptop, what you're going to do is you click on download. You can download it. Now, like I said, you can see all their color code, the RGB. You can see them. All right, you can see everything is here. So once you download it, come to your download here. You can see this is the one, this is the previous one I got. Now this is the one I'm showing you guys. Now you can basically drag it to CorelDRAW. As simple as that, right? Drag it to CorelDRAW. Now, if you want to get this color, you can actually simply use your color picker tool, right? Click on your color eyedropper tool, point to this part, and once you click on it, you can see your color have changed. You can actually drag this way. Or you can use your, um, just drop it to this part. All right. Then you can use your color tool again. Pick this color. Use your color tool again. And, um, and pick this color. Use your color tool again, drop it. Use your color tool again, pick this color. You can pick as many color as you want. Let me drag the second one, which I initially brought. Now you can actually, you can, you can keep this one, all right? Keep this one, bring another one here. Now you can pick this color, right? Pick this color. I'm just trying to show you guys how to pick color, how you're going to pick your colors when you, when you get them. Now, if you're using this, let me delete this one. So if you want to make use of this color, now you can differentiate between your secondary color and your primary color, right? So you can actually use this one as maybe, let's say your primary color, right? And this one's are the secondary color. You can use them for highlights, all those stuff, you know? A lot of just play around it. So these are these are places you can generate colors for your design. So guys, if you have any question, please you can drop me a comment in the comment section below, and make sure you share this video. And see you guys. 
A minus video.